Hello and welcome back to another Future Doc House production. Let's talk about how to study medicine. I get a lot of questions uh, on my uh, channel about how I study medicine. Am I a genius? I'm not a genius. Medicine's not rocket science. You just gotta put the time into it and study it very hard. All right, let's talk about how to study medicine the lazy, easy, and efficient way. Number one, read the book only once. If you're lazy, you don't want to read the book again. You don't want to read a thousand page pathology book again. You only want to read it once. And when I read the book, I only read it once and I take detailed notes, okay? What does detailed notes mean? It means that I read 10 pages and I will take one page of notes, detailed notes, for those 10 pages that I read. So if I'm reading 10 pages about the skull, the human skull, and I noticed that there are, you know, they're talking about the skull, they talk about there's an orbito here, there's a nasal fontaine here, uh, there's mandible, there's teeth. I'm not going to write that down. That's general knowledge. What I am going to take notes on are the details. For example, there's a hole here. Do you see the hole here? Do you see another hole here? Yes. What's that hole is? What was that hole for? It's for the trigeminal nerve, or one branch of it. There's three branches. Okay, so I'm gonna write detailed notes about that, okay? I'm not gonna write about the mandible. I already know that. I'm not gonna write about the cheekbone, the zygomatic bone. You know, I, I know all those things. And you probably should too, so don't write general knowledge. Write detailed knowledge. All right, let's talk about understanding concepts, okay? Try not to memorize Medicine, yes, medicine has a lot of things you must memorize because it just doesn't make any sense. And in my lectures, I try to tell you what to memorize, what not to memorize, but try to understand the concept, try to understand how the body works, how the pathology, the disease works, and you will do much better on your exams by understanding concepts and not trying to memorize everything, okay? Yes, there are lecture notes. Even my videos are lectures, and my board is full of notes. And you can use these videos, you can use these lecture notes, you can use these slides from your professors, but don't use them to memorize what's important. Use them as guidance on what you focus on when reading, okay? You see an outline, uh, you see the notes, and you say, oh yeah, my professor mentioned this, and I'm reading about it. Okay, maybe I should actively try to understand this concept, try to memorize this concept, try to you know, write detailed notes on this concept because it's going to pop up on a United States Medical License exam or uh, uh, your in-house medical school exam. All right, and practice, practice, practice. Reread your notes, use flashcards, make flashcards, uh, and use practice questions. And I'm, I'm working on creating a website to supply you with all my notes, uh, with my flashcards, and with some practice questions so that it will help you succeed uh, in your future studies in medicine. Right? If you like this video and you want more of these videos, please click subscribe. Thank you and have a nice day.